Hello, my friends! I know I'm like 10 days late to the party here, but... I'm gonna... I'm gonna play Cyber Shadow today. So this came out actually three days ago for me. It's the 29th when I'm recording this. And I've played a little bit of it, and I gotta say... Uh... I don't know. It's good. It's pretty good. But it's also kind of like, I don't know. You know, I, I don't know what to expect. I don't know how far along I am. I'm kind of far along, not really. I'm the slightest bit far along, which sucks just a, a little bit because I don't, I don't know, again, what to expect, I guess. Because it's like um, you get through the first level and you're already at like 10% full completion which is wacky but I don't know man ahoy pal sorry to cut your recovery short but our master needs help my name's legion elgin ljn hold on anyways we're gaming my friends check this out wall oh hey Andy give us health you know what, I'm talking to the- I'm talking to the robot. That's it. Make matters worse, I'm pretty sure you're awakening. Yeah, actually these are- these are the freaking egg stasis button things from- from freaking cave story. I don't believe there are actually any secrets here. Wouldn't that be cool, huh? But I don't know that you can even actually- actually access this area after you leave it, so... <laughs> you probably can. For all I know, I'm, I'm just completely wrong. Anyways, we're gonna be doing chapter one today. If I can, heck, I'm kind of bad at this game. Not really, but you know. Also, apparently you get like an achievement or something if you don't kill anything for like the first level. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try my darn just to not kill anything. And it's not gonna work. Like, I really like killing things. And there I go, killing again. Well, I'm, I haven't gone killing again yet, but... I want to say there's a guy that you actually can't get past, though. Like, how would you not kill him? Maybe. Maybe you can get past him. What about that guy? Okay, hold on. At least I got health. Hey, I found health, my friends. How do you get past this, man? Do you just damage boost? I guess. No, you can't. What the heck? Hold on. <laughs> you can't? Hold on. That's not cool. There's actually, like, a feat for it. You get, um... Something. Oh, I don't know. For all I know, there's like a tiny ledge right here. No, there straight up isn't. You actually have to kill him to get past. That sucks. Yeah, what are you supposed to do there? That actually like a- hold on. Reach Smasher without killing enemies. Is this faulty game design that I see? Is there- is there a bad in the Matrix, my friends? I've been waiting for this game for a while, and I don't know if it was, like, me being an idiot. It's- it's- I'm not gonna say that it's disappointing, because it isn't. It, it's pretty good. I guess, like, uh, these people made Shovel Knight, man, you know? I don't know what to expect, really. And I go dying again. I hate those things. They're- and then I get sent all the way back here. I don't know if I want to, um... It's gonna really suck if that freaking thing that you can't literally can't get past counts as an enemy. Because I, I was actually looking to get the feet. And it's honestly quicker to just not kill anything. Why would I bother? Ah, uh, you idiot. I'm pissing on the moon. And I, of course, am getting hit by a lot of things anyways. This is what I don't like about freaking cat and mouse programming, you know? I'm gonna get hit, alright? I'm just gonna kill things. You know what? Screw it, man. I've already pretty much lost it. 
What does it matter? Whatever, man. If something comes at me, it's dead. Consider it done, my friend. Yeah, I I don't care anymore. Okay. It's like I I it get it kind of gets into bullet hell territory. Not really. It's a it's a ninja gaiden. All right. This is how I was always going to consider it as a ninja gaiden. It's a gaiden, my friends. It's not bad, but it's like it's kind of hellish. I would say. Like that! What? Okay. I get it, but I don't like it. You can't stop me. Who really can't? I'm yanking this, though. Guess what, pals? I'm filling up an amulet. Think. Also, this entire enemy is kind of garbage, because there's overheads and straightforwards, and also you get blown backwards no matter where the enemy came, the attack came from. So that's kind of something. That's another impassable enemy, hold on. You literally can't you you can't. You actually can't get past him. Unless you're unless you're like invincible, so. Hmm. I don't know about this one, pal. I'm gonna try and go for the one where you beat the boss without, like, destroying stuff. Also, bullets go through walls. That's also something. It's like, I'm... I'm, I'm trying not to be overcritical of the game, because it's not going to be Shovel Knight. You know? It was never going to be Shovel Knight. But, um, I don't know. I was expecting Shovel Knight, my friend. Where's the Shovel Knight, you know? I don't know. It's like, it's also kind of, I, I guess I was expecting more of a messenger, you know? I like the messenger, I really did. It was a great game. Oh, here we go. Smashing, isn't it? Okay, I might have to kill this stuff on the walls. Like, look at all this. What the heck? Oh, god dang it. That was an accident. I think it might not count because the, it came back. Okay, yeah, it, it didn't. It didn't count. Unless feats go by... Without taking damage. Without destroying the pop-up turrets. Oh, wait, no, that was something else. You know what? None of this matters. <laughs> Alright, now I get unlimited HP. Okay, it's not unlimited. Also, hey, look, things I can't break. That's just kind of how this game goes. I can break this, though. Not that it matters. It's another thing I can't break. Okay. The attack is kind of bad. I'll be the first to admit that the attack is bad. Not even just kind of, actually. The attack is straight up bad. For how much range... And just, like, the fact that it does touch damage that other enemies have. And the fact that they can go through walls. The, the attack is bad. Alright. It's honestly, almost exclusively, the fact that enemies can go through walls that makes the attack bad. Not really. But it's, it's like, like that. There's not even any kind of grace, I suppose, if they fall on you because you hit them. The blade extension, my fellows. Not that it means anything. I don't know. Again, I'm trying not to be critical. Over critical, I guess. I think that it's fair to say, like, that, I guess. I'm not saying that Yacht Club freaking did a flop here or anything, but it's, um. I guess just not really expecting, I suppose, is all. Okay, bruh, I thought you were gonna run into the trash compactor or something. Ooh, boy oh. I wonder if it stops my momentum in midair. Yes, it does, okay. But I can still control it, so that's fine. I'm just saying it's a good thing I didn't land on any spikes or anything. Okay, watch this. 
I was about to die. Just in case you hadn't noticed. I, this is the area that I went through like three times on my first playthrough of the game. So nobody can tell me to like shoot enemies here. I'm not going to do it. I'm not fighting anything in this entire area. Even here, I am not going to do it. I'm, I'm gonna be careful, alright? You can't tell me to not, because I died here so many times. And of course that does touch damage. Oh my lord. Why wouldn't it damage me? Anyways, HP my friend. Shout out to me getting up to the top there and then getting hit by the little, the little... Oh, come on. And I'm back here, by the way. That's my least favorite part of this. And also this freaking flying bug thing is following me now. Try it, boyo. Yeah. And I didn't make that jump. I don't know. I, I, I kind of dislike games in general where the precision for the player is more, like, infinitely more so than the enemy. I guess what I mean by that is the whole, like, there is a lot of mobility. There, there is a lot of enemy freedom and little character, like, player freedom. To an extent. It, it doesn't, it actually gets better later in the game. Not really, but, like, I don't know, this is kind of Kid Icarus, you know? You, have you ever... Well, I've never played Kid Icarus, but, you know... Um, I'm told you start in hell, and then the game gets easier as you go on. And not in, like, a you-get-better-at-the-game kind of way. In a legitimate, the game actually gets easier kind of way. And that's just kind of, um, like, really, you know? Oh, wow. What a babe! Oh, that's not cool. Okay, let's see if I can survive on one health. Give me health, please, dear lord. Thank you. You don't look so good. Your condition is worsening. Our master needs you at full strength. Well, I guess I'll uh, be at full strength then. I really hope... Oh, boy. Shadow is weak as ever. No matter. You'll fade into the ethos. Also, here's the thing about this guy. The first time I beat him, it's not actually hard, because you just jump behind him, but I don't want to do that this time, because he'll, he'll, he'll call me, like, weak, and I don't want that. Not a weakling. Like, if you get, if you do back shots, he'll specifically point out that you did frickin' shots to the back, then he'll be like, even, even, even your puny master said that that's stupid. And then I would just kind of feel bad about it, you know? I feel like I dishonored my clan. But hey, I've, I've memorized the attack patterns now, so I have no reason to be against it. See, I got an achievement for that! I fought with honor, my friend. I can never tell what our master saw in you. But I'm sure the doctor will find use. Run along, little fox. Alright, see you later, pal. Anyways, I'm gonna beat the heck out of this man. Hey, look, a tube! Oh, boy, one of my clansmen has been captured. I'm too far gone, but there might be help for the others. Here, have this. Oh, yeah! One of my friends died! <laughs> And now I can throw shurikens. Also, look at this frickin' pinup I've got. Oh boy. Anyways, I'll be looking at that later. <laughs> and that's chapter one. That's the whole thing. And in case I, you thought I was joking, yeah, I'm already at 10% total completion. So there's that. I'm assuming that there are uh, upwards of eight chapters. Maybe even actually only... Well, hold on. This is two. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven, maybe eight. It doesn't look like it. So seven chapters, and I'm already at 60% completion for this. Which, a lot of it is actually just that you can't do it when you're first running through. So, you know. This is gonna be fun.
And then I'm going to have, like, an episode at the end where I just run through the game looking for things that I didn't find the first time. Or I couldn't access the first time, things like that. So, you know. Um, until then, like, comment, and subscribe, or I will fight you with honor, and you'll still lose lol. Isn't it hilarious how war has gotten so dishonorable and all that jazz? I'm actually at a point, sort of, where I would almost rather we all just kind of line up and shoot at each other and hope that it works. But then everybody would actually die because guns have gotten so much better than they used to be. So maybe that's not a good idea. Anyways, goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.